Alrighty. Here we go. Yeah, take another bite of this burrito real quick. All right, <clears throat> here we go. So last time we were heading down into Gaia's Naval, making our way because uh, May there said that we could find an armorer who can make us an axe. And we need that axe in order to help her save Dylok, her lost love who was sent away to war to go fight the witch. And apparently her dad was cruel to do that to her. Which makes sense to me. So now, we're heading down into the Gaia of Navels. Or the Navel of Gaia's. One of those type of things. And I have freshly brewed really, really bad coffee. But it's coffee nonetheless, and thus it has caffeine in it. So cheers. Yeah, let's switch this up a little bit. There we go. Ah, terrible coffee. Let's go. Very odd segment of the wall here, isn't it? Weird. Man, we are just wrecking these goblins, though. <laughs> All right, let's head downstairs. We've already actually been through this. We went over to the left and we uh, pressed a button that lowered the lava. Wait, hold on. First, was there another door on the other side here? No, there wasn't. I don't remember much about this game, guys, so we're going to be doing a little exploring and stuff. Huh, we made one of the uh, goblin guards despawn. Aren't we clever? Oh, wait. We need to go explore over here, though. Oh, they respawn now. Okay. Here we go. Whoa, how did a mushroom get down here? What? <laughs> Wait, is that really a, an enemy that just spawns down here? What's in here? Oh, secret treasure. Get him with a sneaky level one upgraded attack. Let's actually, I wanna make sure the girl doesn't have, oh, she does have a level one charge with her sword. I don't know if we want her to do that or not. Right, yeah, let's have the girl, so you can, uh, in case you weren't here earlier, we can customize her action 
so that she acts in different ways, more aggressive, charging up her sword. Found the magic rope. Ha, ha, we did it. Okay. Killed that. Wow. She's kind of a beast when she uses the plus one attack. Also, she got a crit there. Makes her even more a beast. Mike reached level nine. Huzzah! Let's go ahead and kill some bats. Help. Go. Oh. But the hold on, something dropped a chest up there. Er, no, it's gone. <sighs> Kill some goblinos. slimes. They're great for XP farming, apparently. Not great for getting past, though. Get out of our way! Almost got him. Almost got him. Wait, did that chest just run away from us? I love that the chests have feet sometimes. Get past those spikes. Strange. Guess we'll go down these stairs. Anything in here? Anything up here? Huh. How do we get up there? Why is there half a staircase? What kind of a house is this? So now we're on the other side of these spikes, but we still can't go by them, huh? Interesting, but we did lower a uh, platform, I guess. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. Amazing music. Let's, uh, let's go see what this Excitement is all about. Oh, hey, little dwarf guys. Hello, little dwarf guy. Hi, Armal. You must be from the surface. I'll grow a sprites child was washed down here. It's during magic tricks. Oh, really? Magic tricks, you say? 
You can hear rumblings from somewhere deeper than here. Sounds like digging. I've heard that on the way down here. It was quite annoying. This is the village of dwarves. Well, hello. Hello, dwarves. Hello, Mr. Shopkeeper Dwarf. Innkeeper Dwarf. One that is 15 GP. Want to stay? Sounds like a ripoff to me, but sure. We'll give you 15 GP. Save your game. Yes, we will. Anything else around here? Nothing. Okay. Okay, let's go into the armor shop. What'll it be? Power wrist. Elbow pad. Do those go in the same slot? Wristband. Spiky suit. Midrobe. Headgear. Let's go ahead and buy some headgear. Spiky suit. Power wrist? I guess two power wrists? And... I guess that's it. Let's head out. Nope, I'm good. Thank you. Be seeing ya. Sure will. Let's go ahead and go equip. Ooh. Wow, his armor was only three, now it's 13. Still not as good as her Kung Fu dress. Okay, so let's equip her. I already got the headband equipped. Give her this. Oops. There we go. And let's go sell the stuff we don't need. Let's remember to keep our inventory organized. Oops. Anything else? Sell. We want to sell this. This. We've already got a lot of money. We need more stuff to buy. Lasagna. See ya. Zaijian. Go in here. Hello. Ho ho ho. Welcome to the village. Welcome to Dwarf Village. Have you been next door? There are many curious things in this village. Why not take a look? Oh yeah? What what sort of curious things do you have in this village? I guess I'll take a look next door and find out. What could it be? What's going on over here? Step right on in. It's the Dwarf Village World Famous Exhibit Hut. Elder, me? Nah, no, I run a show. Wanna see it? You'll be 50 GP. Fine, let's see it. The show's just starting. First, cast your eyes on this rabbit man. The only one in the world. 
Take one rabbi and one man, and it's rabbi man. Hey, you, pipe down. And now, presenting an actual and very rare sprite child. Ah, it's tiny. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, won't you help me? Won't you please help me? Yes, folks, it's pure tragedy. Weep as you hear his story. <clears throat> this poor child has a 50,000 GP debt to pay off. It's here, working off the debt bit by bit. Oh, please, gentle people. Please help it. Even 100 GP will help. Sure, I'll give you a hundred GP. Oh, Joel, thank you. I'll take that. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Can we see the show again? That was not worth 50 GP. But we did help an orphaned sprite child, right? He had a 50,000 GP debt to pay off. We helped him a little bit. Wonder what's going on in here. Well, how was that? What an actor I am. That guy was even crying. Well, I wasn't too bad myself. Ha, huh, we're gonna make a fortune. Hmm, something fishy's going on here. What is going on? Who do you guys think you are taking money from us? Oh, did you just overhear what we just said? Oh, please forgive us. This child really is a sprite child. It used to live in the sprite forest, but a flood brought it here. I thought I'd help it earn the money to return home. Good idea, huh? Hey, you have to apologize too. Oh, oops. Oh, okay. I was wrong. I'm ashamed of myself. I'll return your money. Well, thank you for that. Sorry. Didn't mean any harm. Yeah, of course you didn't. You're just scamming innocent customers and only giving their money back when they catch you, huh? I don't know if I like that. Underground palace? That's been buried for ages. My oh my, you're from the surface? A while ago, a spreads child watched down. Blah blah blah, we already talked to you. Do I talk to this one? Do I already talk to you? This is the village of dwarves. Do I talk to you too? Okay. Huh. Well, what are we supposed to do now? What's this? Looks like a hammer and anvil. Maybe that's the armor guy we're supposed to talk to. Whoa. You look scary. Are you like a demon? Say, show me that sword. It's covered with rust. It'll break in no time. I am Watts, the blacksmith. I'll reforge it for 100 GP. Please do. That sounds awesome. It's been uh, languishing in a rock for millennia. Right, wait a sec. Thank you, sir. It's done. I've never seen a sword as fine as this one in my life. I hope someday I can forge a splendid sword. Huh? What on earth? My hammer has started to glow. Wait just a minute. That must be the mana sword. Astonishing. 
Perhaps the power of the mana sword has seeped into my hammer. Great. Think I'll try and make an axe with this. Come back in a while. Okay. If you want the axe, come back again later. We do really need an axe. So I'll come back later. How much later? I just need to go like sleep in the end. <gasps> What's going on? What on earth? Something's coming. Uh oh. It's boss time. Yikes. Hmm. So it has viney things and pokeball things. Huh. We can't reach it very well, can we? And it keeps, like, deflecting my attacks? Ow. May, are you okay? Alright. Got it. Ha <laughs> ha. Get a little pokey poke. Poke, 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 poke. Get it. Yeah. Ow. Dang. I legitimately don't remember that being how that fight goes. Yo, what what up, Fandangalo? Uh, no, not my first time playing. How's it going? Hello. This is one of my favorite childhood games. Love Secret of Mana. Way to go! Got the Spears Orb. Huzzah! Thank you very much. I didn't need your help. Hey, sorry about that. This child received such a shock from drifting here. It lost all its memories. It really is ni a nice child. It plays tricks on people sometimes though. Come on, old timer. Give me a break. Take it easy. Tropicalo broke out of a sealed palace. There must be some way into it. There must be a way into it. Your memory might return if you receive some power from the mana seed. What? Really? I'll go now. Right now. Not alone. The palace was buried. There must be tons of monsters by now. Would you be so kind as to accompany this sprite to the palace? I suppose, even though he tried to scam us, I suppose we can accompany him. He doesn't seem like a bad guy. What luck! Did you hear that little one? You gonna come along, pups? Hey, brother! Brother? Uh, my name is Mike. Okay. So, why don't you name me too? That'll make it easier on you. Please, name this little sprite. Huh, what should we name the little sprite? It's a good question, isn't it? His name is going to be New. New. New? What kind of name is that? Like, uh, nice to meet ya. Alright, so we got May and New as our partners. Very good. Works out perfectly. New joined. Good luck. You can get to the palace by way of that hole over there. Oh, great. But there's a lava field with which LNA Mo or but there's a lava field which LNA made to seal the palace. First, you have to go to LNA's castle to ask her to dissolve this, her seal. Wait, LNA? Isn't that the witch that Dilek was going to go fight? You're telling me we have to go just like waltz in and casually just be like, hey, you, you mind letting us, you know, into the, the seal and dissolve it? All right, sure, why not? Elena used to be a good witch, but she's not anymore. 
go north to the haunted forest. Find her castle and ask her to open the seal. Here are a bow and arrows we found along with the little one. Take them. Received Chobin's bow and arrows. That reminds me, Watts the blacksmith was looking for you. Visit his workshop. Oh, maybe our axe is ready. Ooh, we could certainly use an axe. In fact, we need an axe to go to LNA's uh, place. So I said before that I don't usually use the bow and arrow, and I don't usually use the boomerang. So we're gonna use both the bow and arrow and boomerang this time around. <laughs> Should be fun. Well, I tried making an axe, but it's no good. Wonder why? Got a boomerang, huh? Wait, I know. Try holding this axe. That's it. Mana's power in these weapons doesn't work until you hold them. What's so special about me? I don't understand. This axe is mighty special. You could even smash a boulder to bits with it. Take it with you for 100 GP. Well, can't say no to a weapon for 100 GP, so thank you. There should be more mana weapons to find. Bring them to me. They need to be forged to release any mana received from the orbs. And only I can do it. Now, let me show you a shortcut. This will make it a lot easier for you. Oh, thank you. Well, I guess what we're gonna do is we're gonna go... Give May the axe, just so we have it like readily accessible. Having boomerang, axe, bow as our weapons <laughs> seems like a bad recipe, uh, but should be interesting to try. Huh. Hmm. Okay, so I guess we can't go through here. Like they said, there is lava blocking our path. Fine game, fine. Oh, let's actually... Hold on, hold on. Let's take a look at our sprite guy. What sort of stuff do you have equipped? So you have a midrobe and nothing else. Okay. Let's buy you some gear. We got lots of money to spend. Power wrist, yes. Spiky suit, yes. Rabbi hat cap, yes. All right, nothing else? No, thank you. Let's go ahead and give our... Sprite dude a rabbit cap. 